just uh, a little bit about Brandon McGee um, coming in from the NFL. How, how's he? How's it going for him, man? He got a nice hit there, driving a couple of runs, chipping in in the outfield. What some general impressions of him so far? Well, you know, he's an athlete, um, a guy that uh, uh, has you know multiple tools and. Uh, uh, just trying to catch up on uh, not playing baseball for a little while, and and uh, he started showing some things down on extended spring training, and and you know here he is, and uh, it's nice to see him come out the other night in Hudson Valley, get his first hit, and then drive in a couple of runs right there that kind of sealed the game for us, and um, he, he's playing uh, with a lot of energy, brings a lot of passion and energy to to the clubhouse, and um, he works hard, really does. He had some good bounce the first time. He really got a good solid piece of the ball. I mean, for a guy who probably hasn't played like you said in three. Or four years, and they get the toll of hitting people in the NFL. Right, right. Yeah, um, he, you know, that first ball, he really stung on the on the screws, and uh, the center fielder really made a nice play running it down. Uh, that ball gets to the gap. He's probably with his speed, he probably has a triple. But uh, you know, that, that's what they get paid to do too, is go out there and run them down. So, um, but it, it's nice to see he had some good at bats tonight, uh, going in and, and finding a good little rhythm and a pace, and, and felt comfortable. Uh, Tucker Tubbs again. He gets a, a big hit, drives in a run, and again, he, his double and speed, he scores on a sack fly. And <laughs> Does it all for you guys? Well, he, 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 you're starting to see guys that are starting to separate and stand out, and uh, he's definitely been that uh, the first week and a half of the season. And, and uh, we knew coming out of college that uh, he was a run producer, and, and uh, he's he's gotten off to a good hard, uh, hot start and uh, um, had some good at bats and, and some big at bats for us. So it's nice to see. Uh, tonight, you get, get hitting again, up and down the lineup, but you're pitching. Uh, you know, some wild spots that you walk some guys whenever they needed big pitches right through from starting through the bullpen, they got the job done. Yeah, uh, you know, Cozart had a little bit of uh, uh, control issues tonight, uh, walking some guys, and um, we seemed to make some plays for him, and uh, he actually pitched out of a couple of jams himself, uh, uh, coming up with some big pitches. So, you know, hopefully he can uh, get that ironed out between now and his next start and uh, find a better rhythm. Um, you know, he's going to be a big part of our rotation and uh, be somebody we're going to start leaning on a lot uh, throughout the rest of the year. Seven and one, you got to be pretty pleased with these guys around. Well, I, I, you know, I don't want to say too much about it. I'm, I'm, I'd rather be seven and one than one and seven. <laughs> Let's just say that. You just talk about how the game Chad had tonight. Um, you know, he hadn't played in a few days. Uh, uh, you kind of worry about the rust. Uh, he had three doubles tonight. Um, you know, they were big, big hits, and uh, it was nice to see. Uh, you could see like a, a weight lift off his shoulders when he finally got his first hit. So uh, maybe he was pressing a little bit, trying to do it too soon, uh, but had a big game for us and made some nice plays on defense as well. Thank you.